That's Philip, isn't it? Is it Philip? Phil? Chinese? It's Chinese. Good. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Rick Taylor. Oh, thank you very much. Cool. I'll do a couple. I'm going to uh, get a couple of the band guys up for the first time after the uh, at, at the third song. Okay. different meanings of silver spoons. It's called Always Towards the Sun. 
<clears throat> now this next song, if I hesitate here and there, it's because I'm still learning the words. Uh, this is for those of you who have dogs, and you know you go down the backyard and clean up the poos by whatever means you see fit. There's always a little bit left, and uh, that's where the dog likes to roll, right there where that little bit's left. And everyone's dogs, it's a funny thing, dogs have very similar habits even though they've never met each other. I mean, how is that? There must be some instinct or something like that, you know. And, and when you see them doing the old drag along the front feet and dragging along and that's okay out on the grass. When they start doing that on the carpet inside, it's time to get them outside. That's not a good thing. So, so there's a, a, a true story about a dog. Every, everything in this song is a true story. And people will recognise, who have dogs, will recognise some of this, I think. He lies in his chair, sleeping all day long. And my friend comes around, said, man, that dog is strong. I said, he pulls like a husky and backwards as well. He said, I don't mean his strength, I'm talking about his smell. Now he won't jump up on you or lick you on the face. He's polite and well-trained and understands his place. And even though he knows much better things to do, he'll come up to your leg and rub his smell on you. He likes to roll on the grass where he sometimes drags his ass. I know it sounds obscene, but he likes to roll around where the poo has been. Puts his nose on your leg or licks you on the hand. Just trying to show affection the only way he can. When he'll rub up on your leg, you can never really tell. He means well, he's trying to share his smell. He likes to roll on the grass where he sometimes drags his ass. I know it sounds obscene. But he likes to roll around where the poo has been. Cattle dogs, hunting dogs, and poodles, they like the grass where the poo has been. Sometimes barks at dogs he hears down the street And when he's in the mood drops his ball at your feet And when he's chased it long enough he just pisses on the ball Cause he knows you won't touch it at all Yeah he likes to roll on the grass where he sometimes drags his ass. I know it sounds obscene, but he likes to roll around where the poo has been. Cattle dogs, hunting dogs, and poodles, they like the grass 
where the poo has been. Yeah, cattle dogs, hunting dogs, and poodles, they like the grass where the poo has been. They like the grass where the poo has been. Thank you. And it's uh, fairly obvious that song's called Where the Poo Has Been. <laughs> right. Okay. Now I'm going to get the guys up. I don't know how we'll do this with me sitting down, but I'm sure we'll work something out. We'll get Richard. Uh... I'll just pull this up just a little. Okay. Yep, still hear me. Cool. Where's Richard? Oh, Richard. Richard, he's an essential part of the song because we talk about a violin in this song and um, it'd be a bit sacrilegious to play a song with a violin in it and, and not have Richard in it, I think, you know. It'd be blasphemous. It would be. It's a bit of a 3, 4, E and C kind of a thing. Right? Yeah. And the solo chorus, just wherever you play, just, just play loud if you feel like playing loud. That's a good way to do dynamics. <laughs> and you've got the solo chorus. We did this one the other night. Yeah, yeah, I've yeah, got to remember. Yeah. Oh, you and me both. <laughs> <laughs> um, this is called Music in the Valley. And it's kind of... It's dedicated to anyone who's had their home displaced by whatever. In this case, it's mining. A true story again about a number of things. Oh my, forget the harmonica, mate. I'm just, uh, what do you like playing with the harmonica for that? Yeah. All right. So I'll just play the harmonica real soft in that chorus and he'll play over me. So I'll just come in. And I'll get off to one side slightly, that's better. That's it, good. And if you want to play with the fiddle on the solo, as a... As a think about it. What? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, depends if the song's good enough. All right, folks, here we go. valley has gone Yet still I can hear the music and songs We used to play our music back then Now sometimes I wish we could do it again When we played our Guitars with the old violin, the banjo, the sweet mandolin. There was peace in the valley, the air sweet and clear. No one had nothing. the coal company came smooth words to disguise their evil game and the payment they made was a token attempt what they did to the land was beyond all contempt when we played our guitars with the old violin, the banjo, the sweet mandolin. There was peace in the valley, the air sweet and clear. No one had nothing to fear. They 
cut the trees and strip the land bare. Not one blade of grass was left standing there. Now an open cut mine is as ugly as sin. But don't try to fight it, you just cannot win. When we played our guitars with the old violin, the banjo, the sweet mandolin, there was peace in the valley, the air sweet and clear. No one had nothing. Yeah, the old home in the valley is gone Yet still I can hear the music and songs We used to play our music back then Now sometimes I wish we could do it again When we played our guitars Angel, the sweet mandolin. There was peace in the valley, the air sweet and clear. No one had nothing to fear. Yeah, no one had nothing to fear. Thank you very much, folks. Rick Taylor, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you. Well, that was dedicated felt like to the residents of Bolga in the Hunter Valley, by the way. Of Bolga. Bolga. Very under yeah. threat from the open cut. Oh, Completely okay. dropping them in the valley. No more Bolga. Okay. Very close. All right. You won't see it in the media, though. Rick Taylor. Um, felt like an old country waltz, didn't it? Yeah. Especially with the fiddle. Hey, Michael. How are you, mate?